Well, hello, 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 and welcome back to another episode of Transport Fever 2. We are in the beta testing times, the beta testing times. Last night, I did a little video, the beta was released. Have a quick look around, and we chose a map. This map is here. We are currently in the town of Faisley, which is going to be our first place we develop. Um, ladies and gentlemen, this is a beta test of the game. The update is due in a month's time. Things may change. Stuff may happen. Glitches may happen. Bugs may happen. All etc. Which is why we wanted to start a new map and not potentially screw up one of our old maps. Um, if you want to take part in uh, any of the testings of the beta or play these new things that are coming out, then uh, you can check out the first video where I explain how to do that. Um, before we start developing this map, I want to kind of set out some ground rules. Okay, so we want to obviously make a lot of money. Are we going to aim for a certain amount of money? Yeah, probably not, but just a lot of money. Lots and lots and lots of money. But what we really want to do is we want to uh, focus on connectivity and efficiency. Okay. So what I mean by that is that connectivity, we want Nuneaton joined into Phaserly, but previously what I would do is just, oh, okay, there's a, a line going back and forth. You know, no, I don't want to do that. I want to have Phaserly to Nuneaton, and then I want the line going up to Burntwood and to Swinton, Manchester, and then coming back. And I want one train to be doing that. Maybe 10 trains doing that in a circle, or back and forth, all the way around. And then maybe that joins in another loop, which takes in Sherburn. Or maybe that joins in a loop which takes up these cities up here. We want that connectivity. We want regional hubs, etc., etc. And you know there will be places, and it looks like for me for sure, something like Burntwood might end up because from Burntwood we can go to Aylesbury maybe, and then down to Much Wentlock, Oaklehampton, and New Aylesford, another big loop. But then you might have places like Lyme Regis here, down in the little corner at the bottom. It's not really smart to bring this loop all the way down here, so maybe Lyme Regis just goes up, you know, like that or something like that. I don't know. Um, also, thinking about kind of efficiency, we want to start using a lot more kind of hubs, all right? So we can see there's things like... Uh, here we need this coal and we need this copper, uh, this iron, sorry, we take it into here, we get the steel, we take it into here, we get the tools, we take those tools over to Phaserly, we've got a thing. So around about this area here is a good place to put a hub. We can have, uh, uh, you know, a nice circular line, well, you know, maybe not circular, yeah, circular line or, or back and forth of the coal going in, the copper coming in, uh, all of it going into this steel and then all of it being driven into Phaserly uh, as well. You know, so we want to really focus on that connectivity. We could bring some of this bread up there into that similar hub. That hub could then be taking that bread up here to Swinton and bringing back, I don't know, whatever we can get out of Swinton. Uh, maybe fuel, oh, fuel is not a bad one for Swinton. There's two fuel there. And the one there, and that could make fuel and fuel. Who needs fuel down here? Anybody? Nobody needs fuel down here. But fine, if you understand what I mean, connectivity and efficiency are going to be the bywords of what we do. And also future planning. Future planning. Now we can already look at Phaserly, and we can see this is a lovely, lovely city. It's going to be amazing, I'm sure. I would love now to spend probably a couple of million just putting it and getting it bigger and all that kind of stuff, but and making the roads nice. We're going to wait a little bit. We are starting in 1850, so the roads aren't that great anyway, and we don't have things like bus lanes, which is what I particularly like. Um, what we're also going to do is test out this uh, some of the new game concepts. So, say, so take these cherries here. Take them. Take my cherries. Uh, let's disconnect this from the road, and I want to see how long it takes for these cherries to... Uh, for the industry here to close yeah because that's what's going to happen we now have dynamic industries these cities will grow over time and if you remember in the first episode we chose that each city could have up to six industries over time but cities the industries will also disappear if they are unused uh, and then other ones will appear i believe so you know let's see what happens with those cherries how long that takes but anyway looking at phaserly what can we do here and immediately i see a very nice virtuous circle of goodness okay we've got the quarry here we take the quarry straight over here to the brick we take that straight into phaserly we take it back yeah we can then have 
a line probably coming out of phaserly and over towards this way and that line will eventually bring back those tools and possibly have passengers going on it as well so what we want to do is create a massive sort of train station hubby thing around here i guess which will be quite close to the city and eventually the city will grow around it but that should all be good and we can we can deal with that as it comes so to speak uh let's just pop in here delete all of this why did i say remember when we did this, we said, uh, let's put lots of uh, trees on. The trees are going to annoy the crap out of me. I can feel it already. Because um, I'm just going to try and delete stuff, and I'll be deleting one tree at a time instead. There we go. There we go. There we go. Awesome. Now, quite a few people have watched that uh, initial video we did. Thank you so much for that. Please, guys, uh, click the like, subscribe if you can, especially the like button. It really, It's just a really simple way so that I know. Ah, okay, cool. Make more of these videos. Um, uh, views are a little bit less of a scientific way to know that so yeah clicking that like button I go okay cool I should make more uh, okay obviously we're disconnecting this one as well now I don't know why I'm doing that but may as well uh, see how long that lasts I don't think this will change because it's yeah we'll see what happens with that as well all right so now we need to get and are we gonna do it I think we're gonna do it can we afford it probably not ah oh, yeah we can yeah we can all right, okay, so then we need, um, how are we gonna do this? We need some cargo stops, I guess. Uh, like so. We need to see if we can connect you up. I guess like that. Okay, first thing done, and then I guess it's gonna come in we want it to circle her out, don't we? So we kind of want it on an angle. So it kind of, oh, it's a quite a big turn it's going to have there. We might end up coming on the opposite side of Faisalie, actually, over this edge. Um, let's just think about it. The line comes in. What? Line comes in here. Oh, it could go round like that. I think that could work. Maybe, maybe too tight. I don't know. Uh, now that I've placed this, obviously I, I feel like I want to place it again, but that's fine. <laughs> we've done what we've done. Uh, let's go like so. We want to go like this. And I think, yeah, we want to see if we can go around this uh, thingy majiggy. Like so. And then. And then. Uh, let's just see where the track would kind of come out if we wanted to squeeze it out of here. Yeah, we could get it coming through there. We probably want to do it like that. Yeah? Shorten like that and then straight across, stopping here. Um, yeah, let's actually put that there now. And let's do the same. Can we join up these boys? Cool. This is costing a lot of money. Okay, good, 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 good. Uh, we should have done parallel tracks. That would have made things easier because we are going to use parallel tracks. So let's go like a so. No. Yep. Thank you. Um... Hmm. Okay, yeah, 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 no, this is doing fine. Okay, so then what we want to do is the old double diamond. Uh, like so. Yeah, uh, and then signaling. I think we just need to go here, no? I think that should work. Then a double diamond down here. Uh, I'm still not 100% on signaling. I have watched a few videos, but it still confuses me. Uh, like I saw, and then there should be this is coming this way and this is going that way. I think that works. Uh, let's. Oh, you know what? If we're going to spend big, let's spend big. Let's just do it. Uh, back here. So let's find out where we want to put the station here. Uh, I guess like here, 
let's see if we can do this uh, large street medium street is fine like so <coughs> and like so all right uh, then if we drag the train line hook up why is it not catching I said hook up that's annoying it's not doing it one second where's the end oh there oh, I think I went too far like that speeds pretty good I think on most of the line ah oh, should have done double damn it again um, this one yeah let's just do it let's just do it oh, I'm not gonna be able to afford a train am I <laughs> we'll borrow more money if we need to like so like so and then the old double diamonds and then the signal should be here and here remember signaling has to go on the outside basically I think now this is annoying because of those trees why did we put trees where's the track start there could be hard because of the curves. No, it does it. Cool. And then uh, this tree in particular, and you, and you, right? And then like a so. I think that works. I'm pretty. I feel that works. And then this should come back into here. Really? <gasps> of course it should. Why didn't I think of that? Um, okay, wait a second. How are we going to do that? I guess we just do a circle. Hmm. <laughs> um, I should have angled this more. We could have come actually back in through there, no? I guess let's just run it around as a circle. Oi. Go away. Why can't I do this? Oh, I'm on signals, that's why I'm an idiot. Around like a so. Uh, gets pretty slow around that corner, but nothing too bad. See if we can. I, I've got to remember to keep on pressing parallel tracks, it really helps. Uh, you can see there on the little right side we could we could press parallel tracks and do two tracks at the same time like so okay so then double diamond I saw a very good explanation for what the signaling does is what it does is it separates everything out into blocks you get what I mean so it separates this is now a block in between here is a block in between these two is a block that the trains can control once they're in that block otherwise they'll wait for that block to be into their control so that's what a signal does it tells them to wait until they can take control of the block uh, like that and then right okay we've got our first loop we just spent nearly two million dollars on it um, possibly a bad idea but I think I like it I think I do uh, first things first let's get a little bit of um, this going right here coming like that cool um, and then we're gonna find out where the bricks need to go uh, truck unload stop here yep cool and then actually hopefully Let's do this. OK. 
Okay, so that's going to go up and down like that. So then we need a building for the trucks to the modular truck station. Now we're going to want that here. What are we going to do? Uh, platforms, right? No. Like so. That's fine for now. Cool. So there's going to be a line between this guy and this guy. Ah, the new naming nomenclature. What are we going to do here? <coughs> How are we going to work out what this actually is? Um, I think what we need to do is at first we need to say, what is it actually? Um, is this a road, a rail, an air or a sea line? So road is annoying, rail is annoying, they're both the same R's. So what about, um, not track or path or, what's another word for road? Uh, I don't know. Uh, is a vehicle line? No, a vehicle could be a train as well. For now we'll just say road. This is a road line. No, we're going to say rail in a second. For rail we do two R's. Yeah, so for, this is a road line. Yeah. Uh, this is a... Um, this is not a process line, this is a delivery line. Yeah, uh, this is for phase or E. And this is brick. So it's a road, delivery, phase or E brick. <laughs> I don't think that's a good nomenclature. I don't think that's going to help us at all in any way, shape, or form. <laughs> uh, I'll have a think about it. I'll have a think about it. I've got to go to work soon, but I'll have a think about it, about how. And, and please, let me know down below. If you, How do you label up your lines to keep them straight in your heads? Because I have no idea. Now, second line is going to be from here to here to here. Uh, like a lovely circle of goodness. This is going to be an RR. This is a rail line. This is a process here. <coughs> We're doing a certain process here, and this is phasally uh, brick. And we're always going to, I think, focus on the end product uh, in uh, naming nomenclature. Uh, enter. Okay, so phasally. Regular. Oh, this is going to get confusing already. At phasally, what are we going to do? We're going to load up with the uh, stony stuff. Where's that got? Uh, there. Uh, we don't unload anything yet. Uh, maybe we will in the future. If this becomes a hub, it could become a hub. Uh, could you be a hub for me? Sorry. Unload that. Load up brick. And at phasally hope, we unload brick. Okay. Uh, waiting times, we want to reduce down to a short amount of time. 120 seconds is what I want. Everywhere like so and now we have one of the new what's that what's this thing I don't know what that is does that, that does that look new to me it looks new to you <laughs> I mean does it look new to you I don't know what that little thing is I don't know. Okay, fine, it's there. Um, colors, we can do custom colors and stuff like that now. I don't think we need to worry about that, so that's all right. Okay, so that's phasally set up, I believe. We're gonna need a truck stop and a train station, a train building, depot, use the words, like so. We're gonna pop you just here. Actually, no, we're gonna pop you over here. No, 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 here's fine, like this. Let's make this nice, actually. Like here. Like that. And then you're going to come out. Like a saw. Okay, excellent. Uh, and then we need a truck guy. So this actually, we're just going to stick a little bit further out. Uh, over this side of town, I think. Uh, like so. Cool, so first things first, buy a vehicle. Cargo. <laughs> We've got the horsies. Uh, go on to... 
why can't you go onto this? What was that? Wait a second. Why a new line? What? There. Oh, it's because I couldn't see it. That's why. Sorry. I'm an idiot. Um, and then we go like so. And we go like so. And we want... I guess we're just going to go the cheapest one. We can't really afford much more. We just spent a ton of money. No diesels, obviously. There's no electric. There's only one. Well, <laughs> there is only one. Cargo. Box car takes every, no most things. Flat car takes those things. Gondola takes that thing. Tank. Oh no, <coughs> we're going to need some of each. Look at that because that takes bricks. A flat car takes bricks, but a gondola takes a stone. Tank car is useless. Box car is useless. That's kind of annoying. So we need flat car and a gondola. Flat car and a gondola. We're going to alternate just because it looks cool. Flat car and a gondola. 24 capacity. I think that's fine for now. That's costing us nearly a million. Do it. <sighs> Bam. Press fast forward. All right. Let's see what happens. I'll be back. Okay. Here we are coming into our first stop. We've got some bricks on board. Blum, blum, through the double diamond. Into phasally halt. Dropping off the bricks. Did we make any money? We made a little bit. Oh, this has cost us a bit, actually. Oh, so now he's going to come around, pick up this again. Um, yeah, I guess. I guess this should work. And we need more trains on it, to be honest. Honest, That's what we need. We just need more trains running it. Uh, so they're dropping off more stuff and they're picking up more stuff. Um, but this is the first delivery, and that's fine. Now, we need probably to borrow some money uh, and put on maybe two or three more trains and the trains were costing us close to a million yeah so we probably need to do that uh, we could think about also do we do the problem is is that this train is now going to drop off but there's going to be nothing for them to pick up yeah we need trains we need two trains let's just do it let's just do it we can always start again clone done Right, let me come back in a second. We want to see how that goes. I mean, it works. <laughs> Did we make any money? No, not yet. Um, we need more trains on it, to be honest. That's it. We need to get, I think we need to get to a critical mass where there's enough trains delivering enough stuff that it's constantly going. Phasely itself has grown a little bit, which is lovely. Um, we are getting the stuff over here. These guys are in the blue. Uh, they're making money uh, for sure just just these guys are not I've added a couple more um, things to them so they can carry more stuff uh, that should maybe help stuff but it obviously adds to our costs as well uh, going hard on trains first time so first thing especially this is a pretty big loop uh, to be spending all this money on the network and stuff like that was is possibly a risky idea especially in a very hard playthrough um, so we'll have to see how this goes but i think it should be all right maybe i don't know we'll see i'm excited um i like the loop already it looks like a kidney bean a kidney bean loop that's what we're going to call this i wish we could place down signs um that would be a really cool thing can i place down signs i don't think i can can i can i like tag something no i don't think i can do any of that is there like a thing paint tools assets no there isn't is there no uh fine um but yeah i'd love to be calling this the kidney bean loop so that's what we'll call it in our heads kidney bean loop time um anyway look we're losing we're down at minus two hundred thousand. i borrowed an extra five hundred thousand as well possibly this could all be over uh, within the next few minutes but you'll have to wait until the next episode to see that thank you so much for joining me let me know down below what i did wrong I know there's a lot of peeps watching this who like the transport fevers who uh, understand the transport fever who have a better idea of the transport fever than i do um, some of them who uh, make their own videos on YouTube, which are far better than my videos, for sure. You should be watching them. Um, but uh, nobody seems to give me the advice. So give me the advice, people. Let me know what to do. Tell me how to do this properly. Um, I'm here to learn, I hope. Uh, damn, we're going to lose a lot of money. Crap. I think I made a mistake. All right. Bye.